Hi, in this video we're going to be looking at a very useful uh, object in Max, which is the live gain. Um, we can actually find this if we type uh, live into the search box, and it because there's the whole sort of gauntlet of uh, live dot uh, objects, and then we just simply uh, select the object we want, and then we sort of position it onto our screen. Um, so the this kind of object does two types of jobs. One, it meters uh, the uh, input, and then and the other thing is we're allowed, we can sort of change the gain. So we can interact it. If I lock this patch, we can change the gain. So that they're at dB, not dB, and it also meters our input. So if we um, want to put an input on that, what we need to do is if I uh, delete these paths. So if I select the path and then delete, and then right click on the path and then uh, sort of delete, we um, want to give ourselves a little bit more room if we put our uh, live gain in the uh, sort of center here. And what will happen is all of our audio will flow through this. So this one currently has, uh, has two inputs, so we could set this up. This is expecting two channels and we can change that um, at the end. So if I just output the uh, um, whatever uh, a, a sine wave, so the output of my cycle operator will be a sine wave which goes into the uh, input channel one of this uh, gain, live gain, and then I want to route the output of channel one to our um, input of the DAC here. So if I turn this on um, and then turn the audio system on, we see that we have um, some audio coming through here and we can actually hear it. So if we turn this down, upset the dog. If we turn this down, um, we, um, we can actually affect the volume and see the gain at the moment. Now to edit this uh, uh, op the uh, live game, if we click unlock and then right click on the object we want to change, if we have a look at the inspector, um, we can do things like we can change the orientation of the fader if we want it to go horizontal or vertical. Uh, we can also do things like um, we could change the range, that's minus 70 dB to plus 6. Um, we can change the unit style, we've got lots of different things that we can change it to. Um, and perhaps most importantly, we could change this to a, a we'll make this into a mono uh, one. So we could have a mono path, but we could also have a multiple. So if we had eight channels, it would look something like that, but it's a bit busy um, for that. So if uh, currently we've got um, we're just going to use one channel for that. So that's how you change it. And the other thing that might be useful where it says live.gain, we might want to change that to something a little bit more um, useful for us. So we could say uh, output. So that's the um, live um, gain operator.